Okay, so if I walk you through some parts of the calculator first of all. This is our screen. This is where our calculations and answers will show up. Um, we have a number of buttons along the top which may come up. We also have two banks of buttons. We've got these lighter grey ones here and those have our special functions on. And then the black and orange ones down here are our regular calculator buttons. The ones that you'll have on just your average calculator or whichever calculator you have on your phone. Unless you've installed the scientific app that I recommended. Okay, so first off, let's turn the calculator on. And you do that using the on button up here. And you can tell it's on because we get a little zero and a flashing cursor appear on the screen. To turn the calculator off, you can see the off button is down here. Now off is written in yellow above the button. That means we have to use the shift function. It may sometimes be called the second function. And that can be found up here. You can see shift in yellow above this button. It's color coded. So if each of these buttons has a yellow word above it or symbol, and to get to those, you press the yellow shift. So if I go ahead and press the shift, and you can actually see in the top left, I'll try and zoom in a bit. There we go. Can we see in the top left, a little S has appeared when I've pressed shift. And that means the sh second function, the shift function is activated. So if I then press the button that has off above it, you can see the calculator has now turned off.